Hey friends and welcome back to another video of quadratic equations. In till the previous video, we have solved the first three questions of the practice set 2.3, and in today's video, we will be solving the fourth question. The fourth question over here is sine a square minus 12a plus 2 is equals to zero. In our previous videos, we have seen that the coefficient of a square should be one. But in this question, the coefficient of uh, a square is not 1. Hence, first of all, we will have to uh, reduce the coefficient of 1 uh, x, or you can say a, to 1, and then we will continue with our sum. Now, over here, we have 9 a square. And since we want to make the coefficient as 1, so we have to divide it by 9 because over here, the coefficient is 9. Hence, we are going to divide throughout by 9. So we get 9a square upon 9 minus 12a upon 9 plus 2 upon 9 which is equal to 0 and we get a square so the coefficient of a square has become 1 and this is going to be 4 3s are 12 uh, and 3 3s are 9 so we get 4a upon 3 and this is 2 upon 9 now uh, we are going to solve it using the normal completing square method first we will be taking the coefficient of a so half into coefficient of a is what 4 mm -hmm. upon 3 you can mm -hmm. see this is the coefficient of a 4 upon 3 uh, so we have taken half into 4 upon 3 and we get uh, 2 upon 3 because 2 will get cancelled by 4 2 2 is a 4 so we get 2 upon 3 2 upon 3 the whole square which gives us 4 upon 9 now this 4 upon 9 we will be adding as well as subtracting in this given equation so it will become a square minus 4a upon 3 plus 4 by 9 and 2 by uh, 2 upon 9 minus 4 upon 9. And we get the square root of the first term, sine of the second term, square root of the third term, the whole square, which is a and the sign is minus and the root of 4 by 9 is 2 upon 3. And 2 by 9 minus 4 by 9 will give you minus 2 by 9 because the denominator is the same. So 2 minus 4 upon 9 which will give to minus 2 upon 9 and we will send this 2 by 9 to the right hand side and we will write it in the form of a square and we get a minus 2 upon 3 the whole square equals to root 2 upon 3 the whole square which becomes a minus 2 upon 3 which is equals to plus or minus root 2 upon 3 and this will become a minus 2 upon 3 and one will be root 2 upon 3 and the other will be minus root 2 upon 3 since we have plus and minus. And hence we will uh, move on with root 2 upon 3. This minus 2 by 3 will go to the right hand side and it will become plus 2 by 3. Uh, since the uh, denominator is same, we can write it as root 2 plus 2 upon 3. And over here we have uh, a minus 2 upon 3 equals to minus root 2 upon 3. And we will take this minus 2 by 3 to the right hand side. And this equation becomes minus root 2 by 3 plus 2 by 3. And here again the denominator is same. So we write it as minus root 2 plus 2 upon 3. So root 2 plus 2 upon 3 and minus root 2 plus 2 upon 3. These two are the roots of the given quadratic equation. So I hope it is very much clear to you all how uh, we are supposed to solve questions when the a uh, coefficient of uh, x square is not 1. What we have to do is we have to just divide the coefficient with the uh, number uh, present throughout the equation. If you all have any doubts, please just let me know in the comment section. And for more such videos, stay tuned and study with me.